Tilotus, agroplants.org, also known as pink mula mula. So Ptilotus, it's a short perennial, and it's also evergreen, or an annual plant. Uh, be aware that it's a very strong plant, it's also drought tolerant, and it can grow in variety of climates, uh, Mediterranean, desert, subtropical, temperate, or tropical climate. If you would like to grow it, there is a link below and a link in the right top side and you should buy it because this is donation for our channel. Also, don't forget to subscribe. So, the how to grow it. So, hardiness zone need to be from 10B as perennial, short perennial. And as annual, we can be from 2 plus, so it's very strong. And can grow in a short season and also bloom. The flower color. It can be yellow, pink, purple, this is uh, and white. can be more than one color, uh, the majority. And what you see here, as far as I saw, it's white with pink and purple all at the same time. So this is the type that I know. And okay, so some requirements. So if you grow it, uh, you need to know that it needs well-drained soil. And also in the beginning, if you start from seeds, and this is how you should start it, uh, from with moist soil, especially in the beginning. This is why early spring it's a uh, great or even end of the, the winter. If you grow it as a perennial, it uh, can grow uh, in hardiness zone, as I said, 10B plus. It can be most of the year, uh, better not in the summer. And uh, as an annual will be in the spring, if it's a cold area. In the hot area, if you grow it, is in a, you can grow it in the autumn, spring, and winter even as an annual. Major pests are aphids and nematod and it can grow from 10 centimeters to 1.5 meters so it's mean like 4 to 60 inches. It depends the cultivar, it depends the species, it depends the condition, it depends a lot of things. It can be a little bit aggressive plant and it's in the right condition it's a fast growing plant that requires small amount of water. As I said before, it's a draw tolerant plant, so be aware, it's very good. So it's mean like put and forget. Uh, this is why it's a little bit aggressive. This is the way that it's grow. Uh, blooming information. Bloom se blooming season, I would say from the spring to the autumn. And as you can see, the flowers are connected together. It's a lot of little flowers that connected in a, a pyramid of con or con shape or something like this that create beautiful flowers. Except this about the growing, uh, I wouldn't say that there is something special. It's quite of easy. Uh, if you have water in your garden, it might be a little bit uh, reseed itself. So be aware, it's not uh, invasive so much, but it can reseed itself. So if you grow it, it might stuck for a few years until you will get rid of this. But there is no point, it's just beautiful uh, plants with a beautiful flower. Uh, so why not to grow it? That's all from growplants.org. Don't forget to subscribe, visit our website. And of course, if you have any question, just ask. You have here links about more videos, some list, subscribe. And of course, purchase a plant. And this is donation for our channel. I hope you enjoy and come visit us again.